Hey guys, for this video I'm going to show how I get my fluffy blowout. And I'm going to start off on freshly washed hair. I use my Shea Belay Naturals hair products and I use the shampoo and the deep conditioner and my hair feels like butter right now. It's so easy to run my fingers through. So we're going to take our avocado moisture mist and spray that on the section we're working on. And that acts as a heat protectant with the hair with the oils that it contains. It works as a heat protectant and I'm also going to take my olive oil heat protectant hair serum and use that as another barrier to protect my hair from heat damage while I blow dry my hair or put any kind of heat in my hair. So I'm just going to rub that throughout my hair. And then we're going to begin to blow dry our hair. We're going to take our blow dryer and our paddle brush and begin to blow dry that section. So as we're blow drying, we're going to make sure that we don't hold the blow dryer too close to our hair because that can cause heat damage. And especially if you have it too close to the ends of your hair because that's the most brittle part of our hair. So it can cause your ends to break. So we're just going to take our time and not rush it basically. And we're just going to do that for each section of our hair. guys since my hair is so thick and so hard to manage I have to make sure that each section is dry before I move on to if I'm putting heat on it or whatever I'm doing so I gotta make sure that my roots are dry because that's the hardest to get dry so I have to blow dry my hair in layers after I blow dry it in sections just to make sure but when I do my layers I do it with cold air so I'm not putting too much heat in my hair so I'll continue to do that for the rest of my head.
getting to the end of the blow dry. I'm just making sure that I didn't miss any sections. Like I said, my hair is very thick, so I have to go over it a couple times. But towards the end, I just try to use the cold air as opposed to the hot air. So that way, I'm kind of eliminating as much heat in my hair because it takes a lot to get this hair blow dry. You can see the mane I'm dealing with. But I just run the cold air throughout my hair. And when I'm done, it usually gives me a big bouncy afro. So here is the finished look. It gives me a nice fluffy blowout. And you know, I got to feel myself for a couple minutes, play around with it. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you like this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Leave comments down below. Let me know of some future videos you would like me to do. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys on the next video.